Dramatically hotter and drier than first expected. That's the prediction for the official bushfire season which begins tomorrow. Dangerous conditions are forecast over the next 48 hours with fire crews battling more than 20 out of control blazes. A grass fire at Dawson, south of Newcastle, out of control and being attacked from the air. It closed the Pacific Highway and destroyed a shed. Milder temperatures today and light breezes, though the conditions were still enough for fire to take hold. And over the next 48 hours, it's hotter and windier. With every prospect of bringing more difficult uh, and dangerous fire weather conditions. A high fire danger in Sydney tomorrow as the bushfire season officially begins. Already this month more than a thousand fires have broken out across New South Wales and the forecast for spring has swung from unusually wet to instead dry and hot. It's a wake-up call that summer's around the corner. And so are firebugs. Confirmation today, the blaze that came close to engulfing the historic Baron Joey Lighthouse on Saturday is being treated as suspicious, prompting another warning. They're putting our firefighters at risk, they're putting our community at risk, and quite simply, they will find, when they are caught, that they have put their freedom at risk by their stupidity. Fighting the blaze on the Baron Joey headland on the weekend had some real challenges, but next week the fire service is expecting some vital reinforcements. All the parts for two sky cranes are being flown into Sydney next week. They're normally shipped here. The fire service says it's ready. Residents are urged to do the same. She'll be right, mate. Just doesn't cut it. Chris Marr, 7 News.